guys my name is Kaya welcome to my channel if you are new if you are not new what's up and welcome I apologize for my voice right now I'm a little under the weather I know I sound very stuffy I have a lot of just I have a cold okay so that's not the point of today's video to tell you guys about my cold in today's video I am reviewing another unit this unit is from Elemo is how I'm going to pronounce it, E-L-E-M-O hair. This is um, a 360 um, wig that I have, so it is 100% virgin human hair. This is the packaging that it comes in. In my package, they gave me a pack of lashes, um, as well as a little case to like, keep your hair stuff in, or your makeup, lip gloss, whatever you want to keep in it. So you have that. They gave me, a, looks like a makeup sponge. That's nice to have. You know, if you're ever out and about and you need your makeup sponge, you have one. Um, they also give you a wig cap. You know, you can never have enough of these. I love getting me some wig caps. And then they gave me a ragtail comb. And trust me, you guys, if you are into hair, you do your own hair, do hair in general or whatever, this is a staple. You need a ragtail comb in your collection of hair products. So thank you for this. I'm very appreciative. And then we have the lashes. Oops. So, I'm going to show you guys the wig. The wig has already been blow dried and whatnot. Um, it does come completely curly. So, it has a little tag on here. Um, it says, Elmo hair, 100% virgin human hair, unprocessed natural hair, healthy and durable. Hair soft and thick, no shedding, no tangles. So, okay, you claim no shedding, no tangle. We about to see if this is for real. So I went ahead and bleached the knots in the inside um, as well as I added a little golden patch here because I just wanted a little pizzazz to my unit, you know, nothing too special, but yeah, that's what I did to it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put it on. What I'm going to attempt to do today is to put it in a ponytail, high ponytail or bun. I've never done that with any of my 360 um, frontal units, so I'm going to try that today and hopefully it comes out pretty well. If you are interested in seeing how I get this up into a ponytail, you guys, then continue to watch. And also, I did not cut out any of the um, combs in the inside. I'm going to leave them in for now. Maybe in the future I might cut them out. But right now, I'm going to hold on to them. sitting wanted to I did already go in and pluck it as well so it's already plucked So today's glue of choice is going to be this um, Isha Luxury Wig Fashion Absolute Lace Wig Bond Glue. It is water resistant so I'm guessing if you need to take it off you might have to use like their um, glue remover or you can use probably some alcohol. So the directions for this is to shake it well and make sure you remove all oil and makeup not doing that um, <laughs> while you get it on so I'm just going to apply a thin layer of this to my forehead and I am just going to get the wig laid down and then after that I'll probably cut the lace off so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then I'll be back for the styling of the unit and I got this from Janet collection by the way the camera's dying Great. Oh my god, I have makeup on my own. Look at that. That's from my wig from before. The coloring bled on my face. What the freak? I gotta go get that off. This stuff is really sticky. Like, really sticky. Okay, you just go by my own. I know I can't because there's a way. 
My camera's about to die, no! Y'all, I always start talking and my camera, I be realizing it ain't even recording. So I took the wrap cap off that was holding it down, just molding it down to stay. So what I was saying before my camera cut off is that my lace is a little light. So I'm going to go over it with some powder because I did not tip my lace. So, um, yeah, we got to go over it to make sure it's not showing we want it to be blended and this powder does the absolute job you cannot see a thing with this powder yes ma'am all right so i'm gonna go ahead and get this up into shit it's hot 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 i'm gonna go ahead and get this up into a ponytail that glue is so good that my hair is not going to go nowhere, okay? Yes, hold. This hair ain't going nowhere. Okay. All right, you guys. So I have my hair up in a ponytail. It was successful, you guys. So what I did was I used this this glue. This is the Lace Wig Bond Glue. So you guys have not tried this glue out. I would recommend it. But onto this hair, y'all. Um, hello. Can we get into this hair, y'all? This is like some of the softest hair I kid you not and I don't ever really talk about how soft hair is if you are a frequent watcher on my channel you know that I don't really care for talking about how soft hair is I more so just talk about like um like it's 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 style or I talk about how much it sheds or tangles or whatever anyways I never really touch on how soft it is but this is like abnormally soft and I know that sounds kind of bad but I swear I don't mean it in a bad way it's some really soft hair so I don't know what LMO hair got going on but uh y'all got some real soft hair like this hair is extremely soft I love rubbing my hands through it so this is what it looks like in a ponytail I did it kind of like in a messy bun type of look because I feel like I wear my hair like this sometimes sometimes I put it in like you know a real slick pony but I just feel like this is so cute and different for my channel because y'all don't ever really see me with styles like this so I'm going to give you like a 360 view so you guys can see exactly what it looks like up in a ponytail because I don't know if people really do styles with 360 wigs I don't really feel like I see that too much but anyways this is what it looks like up close in the front pulled out the pieces and gave some curls ignore my makeup not being right there because I kind of wiped it off earlier um so ignore that but yes so how does it look you guys now disclaimer it probably does not look the best in the back and I'm gonna tell you why it's my fault okay I didn't cut the lace off before I put the wig on that was my fault and I was like I am not removing this glue so that's my bad I didn't report I didn't take the 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 the, the blah, 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 blah the lace off first I had to cut it just by like guess okay 
Then I also did the glue method, which I feel like since my lace wasn't cut properly and I didn't adjust the straps properly, it isn't like exactly sitting on my head as well. But it's glued down, but it's not glued down like perfectionist uh, like that but I'm going to give you a view of the back so you can see what it looks like it's just not going to be perfect I already know it's not going to be perfect but whatever so this is what she looks like in the back hopefully you can see I'm trying to get close enough so you can see <laughs> but yeah you guys this is what my hair is looking like I feel like I'm headed to like a wedding or a prom or something you know but she's cute now of course I could put this in a ponytail too I wrapped it and made it into a bun because that's more so what I was interested in but you can also do like a ponytail I would probably wet this and make it into like a little happier ponytail. Let me see. Put some water on it and make it wrinkle back up. Not wrinkle, Kaya. Crinkle back up. But um, yeah. So this is how I would do my hair. And I put it in its little bun. You know. And rock it. You feel me? This is how I would wear it. Hopefully you can see me well enough to see what's rocking, to see what's rocking, you know. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yep, 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 yep. But yeah guys, this is a wig you should definitely try out if you were trying to put it up into a ponytail or just trying anything in general. The hair is really, really nice, okay? Um, when I was plucking it, I plucked it with ease. Some of our tools are not very easy to pluck, you guys, and this one was very easy to pluck. Um, like I said, the hair is extremely soft. Like, I'm loving rubbing my hands through this, okay? Um, it took the bleach really well, too. Like, that little piece of bleach I got going on it took that really really good so that's a good sign as well um it also just has a very nice texture to it you know it's just really it's a really good wig okay so if you guys are interested in any more details make sure you check out my description box below make sure you check out LMO hair I'll put everything in the description box that you need in order to get this unit okay thanks guys so much for watching today's video and until next time I will see you guys in my next one you feels me bye guys